Okay, so we have got 25 of these 84 plus player picks. Let's open them up and let's see what we can get. Are you facing ridiculous teams and you're stuck with ones just like this? Well, look no further. Head over to u 7 buycom and get yourself some foot coins using the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for 5% off your order. It'll be linked in the description. They are cheap, safe, and the most reliable. So make sure you go ahead and check them out and make your team better than ever. Okay, boys, so today we are back with a brand new video and as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail etc 84 plus play picks are here again if you remember last time they were absolutely incredible i think they've dropped like a couple of times before and these have probably been one of my favorite things to open up and today we have got a load of them to open obviously there's what ifs impacts as well so fingers crossed we can get some of them some of the big ones the likes of sancho and leandro gomez you know the big boys. That's what we want to see. So yeah, like I always say in every video, thanks to all you guys that allow me to open up your player picks in this video. And also, like I always say once again, make sure you guys let me know in the comments below if you open up a player pick. And if you did, who did you manage to get in your player pick as well? And also, if you're wondering what the requirements are, if you haven't completed it yet, it's an 83 rated squad, one in form, I think 60 chemistry. And that's basically it. It's not too hard at all. Very, very good, I think, for an 84 plus um, player pick like this. I think it's a very good value. Definitely would recommend it. And hopefully, this video will convince you to complete it because pretty much pulls in the video that's all i'm gonna say but anyways let me stop waffling let's get ourselves into these player picks and let's see what we can get all right here we go 84 plus player pick my one the main boy i really want is sancho here but i don't and it's never i never get an untradeable special sancho but let's open it up here we go straight up open i mean it's not bad is it a jovic i will take that what if jovic good start what if Jovic, four star, five star. This card is nasty looking. This card is nasty looking. I'm happy with that. Let's go. B14 Tomo, player pick number two. How many more what ifs can we get? I got a what if again. I got a what if for my 85 plus times five. And also, now my play picks. I'm happy. But what can we see for Tomo here? It's lagging. Uh, what would I go for? I'd probably take. Would I take Gosins because he's a high rated in form? For an SBC or Alba because he's the highest rated. It's a hard one. It's a hard choice. Um, but Gosins, yeah, I probably would have gone Gosins because he's a higher in form. Only two ratings below and high in forms are always useful for SBCs. All right, shout out to Big Mac Kev. Sorry about the quality. It's just um, we're doing it through Twitch and sometimes the quality is not that great. But 84 plus player pick number three. Let's see a mint player here. Let's see a JS7. Let's see something like that. You know, come on. Let's see. All right, here we go. What do we see? Hey, another what if from Bashishe. That's a dub. That's a dub. It's always good to see. And apparently he's solid. I haven't used him. I've got him actually, but I haven't used him. But that's a solid dub in my opinion. All right, here we go. Marab, player pick number four of the video. What do we see? Come on, show us another what if. Doesn't show us a what if, but it shows us an 89 rated Sergio Ramos. That is a good rating for fodder. Also, still probably usable, even at this stage of FIFA. I'd say he's still usable. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Ramos is a sick one to get. That is solid. All right, here we go. Luca Davies, pick number five, I believe. Let's see what we can get him. Come on. Let's see a madness of a what-if card. Oh, no. Is that tradable or untradable? If he's already got him untradable, that is pain in a half. But that would have been an incredible pull from one of these. Yeah, he does. That is a shame. But Ramos is still decent rating. But, oh, that's annoying. All right, shout out to Joe Rodwell. Here we go. Um, play pick number six of this video. Um, best one to beat so far. Probably that Mbappé, actually, the last one. Oh, Cristiano Ronaldo! <laughs> oh, my! With his new picture as well. CR7. Okay, that was probably not the best one. That is probably not the best one. Still one of the best strikers in this game. 100% still one of the best strikers in this game. Goal, Cristiano Ronaldo. That's big. That's big. Yo, don't select him yet. Hold up. All right, shout out to Claps on Twitch for player pick, I believe, number seven of this video. We got her Ronaldo in the 85 plus, I believe it was, times five. So, what do we see here? Anything big here? Ah, okay. That's probably the worst one we've seen. I'm not going to lie. But we did get Erdegaard and Ronaldo in the 85 plus for her. Um, but... Still a walkout. At least there's still a walkout in there. At least it's not four 84s or like 84s on 85. So that's at least, I guess, good. All right, shout out to Blue Army. Pick number eight, I believe. Here we go. Come on. Come on. 
Ooh, Azure or the troll by Jedder or Allison. Yeah, I'd probably go Allison. I'd probably go Allison. I know it's an 86 in form, but that's a plus four for an SBC. I just think the fodder wise, or you could actually use Allison, I guess. I think the rating difference is quite high. Actually, no, yeah, actually, no, it does make sense to take the inform. An 86 in form is actually a dub to have for an SBC, especially. Yeah, that's not bad. All right, shout out to Mads here. Player pick number nine of this video. I love these 84 plus player picks. They've been solid so far. Let's hope they can continue. Oh, Pereira! Pereira is the man, I'm telling you. For the people that are watching this video right now and that are on the stream, this guy is the biggest bargain in the market right now. He can play center mid, cam, all of them positions, left wing, right wing. This guy is such a beast. Hopefully, Mads takes Pereira here. I would genuinely take Pereira 1 million percent, and hopefully he does. He does. So good. He is so good. He can play striker as well. This guy is the best price card in the market right now. He is so good. All right, here we go. Kenks, player pick number 10. Been going through these pretty fast, but they're very fun as well. So here we go. Number 10 for Kenks. What do we see? All right, it's opening. Oh, that's our first non walkout. However, he does have a Rashford in there. Rashford can definitely still be used at this stage of the game. That was probably the only save of this pack, but probably the worst one. Sorry, player pick, but that is probably the worst one. All right, shout out to Goomsters. Here we go. Player pick number 11. Hopefully, we go back to the walkout days and the um, the what if cards in this next one. Come on, then. let's see. Uh, I want to see a Sancho somewhere down the line. That would be incredible. Oh, Yuri Bashisha at the end. Yeah, someone was telling me he's absolutely solid earlier. He could probably play centre back or left back or left wing back, etc. Like, yeah, that's a, that's a good pull to see. A what if he's always dub, always a dub in my opinion. All right, here we go. Ryan C with an 84 plus player pick. Let's see what he gets. Make it big. Not big, but he does get a walkout at least. He does actually get a walkout at least. We haven't really had a stinky, stinky pack yet. I shouldn't say that. Touch wood, but it's a walkout, so you know it, it definitely can be worse. All right, thanks to Dan Mel for the 84 plus player pick number 13. Number 13. Come on, then. Come on then. Ooh, Marcelo recovers it at the end. Marcelo recovers it at the end. I just saw the walk. I was like, eh. Then Marcelo, what if came out? Nice card. Solid card. Nice card. You love to see it. All right, here we go. Sensory. 84 plus play pick number 14 of this video. What do we see? Make it a big one. Di Maria walkout or inform Godin. Inform Godin, I'd go for. I think because he's probably not going to use Di Maria or Henderson. Godin's the best choice. Yeah, 86 inform is always a solid thing to get. Even if they're not usable for SBCs, it's really good for them. Really good. Yo, shout out to Jaden. Here we go. Pack 15 of the player picks. Come on. Big one. Okay, that's not the worst one we've had. That is actually the worst one we've had. Oh, mate. Okay, that is definitely the worst one. That's probably the only L we've actually had out of 15. Ah, oh, that's annoying. That is annoying. That is literally the only L. Ethan, here we go, mate. 84 plus, number 16. Oh, we've got a save there from Di Maria. We nearly got back-to-back -back stinks. All right, shout out to Sib, number 17, I believe. Let's go. 84 plus player pick. He's got control, so we'll let him open it up. Let's see what he gets. Come on. Let's have a big, big dub here. Let's have another what if. I don't think we've had one for like five to 10, maybe. Here we go. Come on, show us a what if. Oh my God, that's the only, that's the second stinky one we've had. That is bad. That is bad. Oh, that's bad, EA. Come on. Better than that. All right, shout out to the man Reflex. Number 18 of the video. Come on, then, EA. Come on, then. What do we see? Ooh, Inform Gozins or Jordi Alba. I'd probably, I don't know if I'd take the Inform again. Like, I think we had the same pick earlier. Like, it's pretty similar, yeah. I probably would have gone for the Inform there, just for SBC-wise. Um, definitely. Good choice. Not that bad of an Inform. An 84 plus Inform is always a dub, in my opinion. It's always a decent dub. 86 plus is a massive dub, though. All right, man like George, here we go. He's got Duke Van Dyke there as well. Interesting. Okay, come on. Oh, my God. Yay! Why? Ah, oh, mate, we were literally getting so many, like, every single one was dubs. I mean, overall, it's still definitely been a dub SBC, but another 85 is the max again. Come on, EA, fix it. All right, shout out to the boy free. Oh, sorry, your boy free, I should say. Pick number 20 of the video. Come on. Oh, Alejandro. Wait, is it Alejandro? I think his name's Alejandro. I know people call him Papu Gomez. It is Alejandro, right? Um, yeah, Alejandro Gomez. That's a massive dub. That is a massive dub. Alejandro Gomez, what if? Wow. That is probably one of the best ones. If not, the best one probably is the best one, actually. Yeah, of the video. Wow. Let's go. Shout out to Beastman, number 21 of the video. It's going to be hard to be like Gomez and Ronaldo, actually. They've both been... Oh, Pereira again. The magician himself. The magician himself. 
Take Pereira. I'm telling you. Take Pereira. He is so good. He could be an incredible impact sub off the bench. You could start him like I do. I start him in my team alongside Timothy Ronaldo, Timothy Fernandez, etc. He's a beast, man. He can literally play cam, centre mid, striker, left wing, right wing. Any of them positions you wanted to play. Left cam, right cam. Beast. And I would take him. Hopefully he takes him. Yes, he took him. Big dub. I wish I got him on my account. All right, shout out to my boy, my very good friend, Lost Mafia. Go show him some love on the Twitch, X Lost Mafia. Go follow him right now, and hopefully we can follow up with a good pack after the last one. Actually, the last two have been incredible. So let's make it a hat trick of what if big pulls. Come on. Oh, wait, is that tradable? I think he might have been tradable. Uh, does he have untradeable? It is! That's a big dub! Back to back to back. What if massive pulls? Come on! Alright, shout out to Caden Pink. Can we keep the big dubs alive? I mean, it was looking bad till I saw Cruz. Cruz is not too bad. 88 rated. Good, good, high rated fodder. Not bad at all. Um, so I'd, I'd definitely take Cruz, unless he's trying to change it to Haaland or something. I don't know. But yeah, Cruz is not bad at all for number 23 of the video. Alright, shout out to the man Wee Deck. Number 24, probably the penultimate one of this video. I think we'll probably probably leave it 25 for this. But they have been good, so they've been fun to open. Let's have a look. Here we go. Come on. Number 24, the penultimate one. Make it a big one. I mean, rating-wise, it's pretty big in Manuel Neuer. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Not that bad at all. 89 rated. Like, if you're not going to get a special card or anyone else, Manuel Neuer is not bad, in my opinion, in the penultimate one for the video. All right, shout out to Akane. This is going to be the final one for this video. What do we see? 84 plus, player pick, final one, making a big dub. Eh, it's not that bad. It's not the worst. It's an 88 rated. It's not that bad to end it on. I mean, we had some massive pulls in this video, so not bad at all. So yes, there we go. Them player picks were absolutely incredible. We saw a gold Ronaldo early on. Obviously, in mine, I got the um, what if Jovic. And then we also got that in for, And then we also got that what if Aliandro Gomez, which is an incredible pull as well. And so many what ifs. We got a few and Babu's in there and some other ones. It was just insane. The Pereira, like I said, Pereira is so good. I would definitely recommend getting him in your team. But anyways, like I said earlier, make sure you guys smash the like button if you did enjoy the video. And also let me know in the comments who you managed to get from your player pick. But yeah, guys, anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.